We're talking about his books. Mm. What did he give up to give us his books? He basically, basically stopped sleeping for 10 years. Um, for all intents and purposes. I mean, he slept for a few hours at night and maybe caught a cat nap here and there. But he, um, he woke in the middle of the night. He wrote um, in the middle of the night. Uh, and then during the day carried on his um, vigorous preaching work activities, establishing, you know, trans transporting an entire culture onto Western, foreign Western soil and um, not only implanted in the hearts of thousands of people faith in bhakti, but cultivated that in such a loving, caring, attentive way for the little guys and the big guys. Everyone got the same um, loving care from him. And, um, and yeah, he, uh, he made all the many sacrifices to give us, to give us the Bhagavatam, to give us the Chaitanya Charitamrita, these two core um, theological masterpieces. And um, he did it in the middle of the night, not even writing. You know, it's one thing. You know, if you take a pencil and you write down your thoughts, that's kind of like you can you can kind of like construct your thoughts a little bit easier. But when you're speaking your thoughts into a dictaphone, that's different. And um, and he didn't go back after those tapes and get to cross out what he had a second thought about, or he just it just came this flow of realization and love. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama.